Binders should be struck from existence. Is that it? Correct. But I am here to test you, not end you. I have no quarrel with you, Zangetsu. Perhaps not. But carnage is the language I speak. If we are to come to an understanding, this is how we do it. Now, fight as if your life depended on it. Go!
me to fight as if my life depends on it when you are clearly not. <laughs> you could tell. With your skill, you could have destroyed me in a heartbeat. I have a gift for you.
What are you doing? My sword. The Zangetsuto. I came to England in pursuit of a demon named Gremory. Only by that blade may she be cut down. Gremory? That's the demon that attends Jeeple. But why give the sword to me? I've tried making contact with Gremory. But I have yet to cross paths with her even once. You think she's avoiding you? She must be. And surely you have noticed. That man you're after, Jeeble. Gremory is controlling him. <sighs> but her hold on him is not absolute. Perhaps you have seen signs. A moment of weakness. Yes. When I faced him on the galleon. Good. That means your ties to Jeebel are still stronger than Gremory's. And she knows it. Which means she will not allow Jeebel to be alone with you. But wait. Why not come with me and do it yourself? Because if she fears me more than she fears relinquishing Jeebel, then we risk losing her. I will have my vengeance on her. Even if it means parting with the sword. And there is something else I need to clear up while you deal with Gremory. All right. I will finish what you started. What I started? <laughs> I am certain you will.
Got any? Here's what I've. Good. I have something new to... What are you looking to buy? Is this... Then we have a deal. Is this... Thank you. Is this... Thank you. Thank you. Hi, Miriam. So, what'll it be? I'll go with this. I'll go with this. Ooh, I like it. I'll go with this. Zangetsu said Jebel is being controlled by a demon named Gremory. Gremory? Of the 72 demons? I knew Jebel wasn't a monster. He's possessed by one. Then there's a good chance we can free him. I'll do whatever it takes. So will I. But Gremory... Oh, this explains so much. Jebel could never have accomplished something this heinous with his crystal alone. Now, adding Gremory's power to his, well, uh, that pushes it into the realm of possibility. Oh, I, I'm sorry. I, once I start theorizing, I, I can't be stopped.
What took you so long? Well, now that you've tasted the power of so many shards, I presume you're ready to join me. You presume wrongly. I'm here to keep my promise to you, and nothing else. What promise? You really have forgotten, then. I swore to you that I would stop you if your Shardbinder power ever manifested itself against your will. <laughs> Please! You think I wield this power unwillingly? I do. I've known it since our meeting on the Galleon. But there was a moment when I saw a flicker of the real Jeebel beneath all that hate. Fool! I've heard enough! If you want to stop me, you'll have to do it by force. As you wish. It's time to free you of this once and for all. Next time, obey. Johannes? I am if you are. Yes. I have a new promise to keep. If you plan to destroy the castle, you won't be able to do it without the Liber Logaioth. Then I need to track down Alfred. Gremory will be after him too. Tracking Gremory might be faster. The moon, you mean? I'll try it. Oh. 
did... Uh, the, the book. The Liber Logaith? What about it? She... She stole it. I brought your apprentice like you... What happened here? Master, who did this to you? Thank you, Zangetsu. Johannes, I must beg a boon of you. What? Uh, all right. Mario, we need to talk. Uh, yes. I... I thought Alfred was our enemy. Dominique seemed so keen on pitting me against the old alchemist that I decided to have a word with him after you and I fought. And unfortunately, he confirmed my suspicion. Which is? Dominique has been manipulating us this whole time. I'm not certain why. Uh, wait, what? If she had wanted to deal with this mess in an expedient manner, she would have sent you and me to deal with Jeebel together. But instead, she divided our strength and insisted I chase after Alfred. It didn't make any sense. Alfred was never trying to get in our way. I'm not sure about you, but he got in my way. You misunderstand. All he wanted was to keep you as far away from the castle as possible. Why? Because you were the most attuned. Attuned to what? Of all the humans transplanted with crystal, you had the greatest ability to wield the demon's power. Alfred feared you would be used. Then why didn't he say so? Would you have believed him? Dominique had already won over you and Johannes both, and even if you had been inclined to listen, he knew you too well to think that you... I... I suppose I wouldn't have. What do you think Dominique is plotting? As I said, I know not. We will just have to find her. Miriam, the Master wants to talk to you. Miriam, forgive me for dragging you into all this. I am responsible for all your misfortunes. <gasps> Alfred! He must have known he would not leave here alive. We can grieve later. Right now, we need to put an end to all this, or his death will mean nothing. <gasps> You're right. Johannes, he explained everything to you. Yes, I know what I need to do. Then let us begin. First, Grimmery. She can't be far, but her mastery of subspace allows her to move about freely. In other words, she's likely to slip away again. I have a way of stopping her from leaving. She knows I have given up the Zangetsuto, and will spring at me then. That is when you strike. I will go on ahead. Join me as soon as you think you are ready. I can't do much of anything until you get back the Liber Logaith. I'm sorry I can't be of more help, but for now this is in your hands, Miriam. Be safe. I will, Johannes. I'll be in the village if you need me.